Hi, I'm Victoria Patton. I am a junior here at the University of Redlands, but I am from San Mateo, California. I am majoring in psychology and minoring in environmental studies, and I am spring 2015 semester uh, student fellow. For my service activity, I worked in Jasper's Corner, which is a program funded through uh, the Community Service Learning Program here in the University. I am a tutor and a mentor through this program, and through this program I work at two off-campus sites, one called Mustard Seed, the other one called Boys and Girls Club. And during my service, I worked with kids from kindergarten through eighth grade, even through high school, and it was a great learning experience. So, right behind me is the Mustard Seed site where I work at twice a week. The other two days of the week, I work at the Boys and Girls Club. But I thought I should hint on what I've learned from my experience from serving the community. Um, from my, what I learned about myself is that I have no patience when it comes to kids under the age of eight. But that's just because they're eight and they don't understand what it's like to put so much focus into their homework and their attention span so little that I lose my patience quickly and that sucks. But however, I can't play with kids for playing games for hours and hours. But when it comes to teaching, that's a little shaky. However, um, but through my service, I've also learned from about the community that the kids, like, they want to do their homework, but the problem is they need, they really do need the help. It's just because their parents either don't have the time to go help their kids out, don't know how to help their kids out, or don't even want to. And that sucks and because, for me, I've had that growing up my whole life with my mom helping me my homework every step of the way. And these kids, like, really do need the help, and these parents really do trust the service that we provide because they either don't want to do it or, or the reasons I've just mentioned earlier. And then I also should mention that the, the impact I've had on my community is that like I've become a mentor to these kids and I've helped them through all their homework and through all their struggles academically. And that's helping them with their work, has, it helps them get a better education, helps them grow as a human being, but also they like believe that they can, they can do it. They, they, you know, they have the ability to go to school and do their homework at the same time. And they also believe that they're capable of more than what they are, what their parents think they are. So I'm at the other side that I work at, which is the Boys and Girls Club. And to end this video, I guess, or to start ending this video, I want to discuss how this service I've done impacts the rest of my life. Or it can be applied to other experiences. And maybe as a college major, I want to go to grad school. I want to go into grad school for therapy, maybe some research. And I really want to go into working with kids in this age group that I've been working with. And so from my experience, I could really apply this, like the understanding, my understanding now of like child development and a little bit of child behavior, like that will bring me a long way. And also from working this service, um, it can apply me to me working in my summer camp. I work every summer, and it's something I'm learning, something I'm growing, trying to learn how to do discipline, how to, to discipline kids, how to apply what I've learned from here to understand kids better, understand what they really need as a person. Uh, so, but one thing is, what's next? Well, I hope to continue working for Jasper's Corner, either as a volunteer, volunteer or even a paid tutor. I just hope that I can continue my experience here and kind of enjoy my last year uh, at the university through these two sites, through the program, through everything. Because of my experience at the California Campus Compact Community Engagement Student Fellowship Program, I am more, very much more aware of the community that I have served in for the past few years. And I, I've learned a lot of, now I'm more aware of the world around me and I would like to take this time to thank the donors and thank the university for this scholarship award. It really does mean, does mean a lot to me to be recognized for all the hard work.